hey guys welcome to my channel so in this video i have something to say that if you don't have movies and tv shows collection in your computer then please start making it why because everybody get bored and when people get bored these days they go to youtube and uh, something like netflix i assume you don't have netflix account so if you get bored you don't have time to download something from you know torrent so you should always be prepared you should always have things downloaded already in your computer and you you know when you get bored you should be able to play it quickly instead of going to things like youtube and watching random people's doing stuff it's always better to watch a proper cinema proper anime some pro something proper all right some well-made stuff and not just some random guy making videos you know like this is just pathetic so also if you think oh, all right but by watching youtube i learned something blah no okay so okay why i did that oh god i regret it okay so yeah so in this video i'll show you like i started doing this and i realized like how much i changed after doing it i watched a lot of good stuff and i decide what to watch so if if it's sunday i i'm getting bored i download a lot of stuff with torrent i just you know uh, find some i do some research and start downloading stuff which i like i you know i realized like i have to watch it so here you can see uh, I in my media so I have a entire one tier one terabyte HDD dedicated to this thing and it get mounted automatically with the this thing etcf step so I have this entry of this drive here so it get uh, you know automatically mounted so here I got a lot of movies so three minus so two or I guess one so I got a lot of movies here. So previously I had these movies like, um, you know, separated by the, by the country, but now it's, it's uh, just straight up like, okay. So we also got a lot of animes here. So, all right, this is not animes. All right. So you got a lot of anime movies and straight up animes. So what I did is I downloaded all of them because I got a lot of private trackers too. So I downloaded some of them from there, but you can get from public trackers. It's uh, just use some VPN if you're not from India. So after that, you know, what I did is I was just watching them from MPV and I was like, you know, this is cool. I got a lot of movie files and I can watch them from MPV. Happy life. Everything is fine. But then I realized that, you know, these files were in my computer, but I was not watching these things too much. Like I was watching, but, you know, like if I'm getting bored, going to YouTube was much easier than going to these files because, you know, MPV watching. I mean, the problem is not that opening take times, obviously not like I can have some FCF script and just open it quickly. But the problem was that on YouTube, you see thumbnails and stuff and this thing psychologically, you know, just uh, if you have some mechanism to present everything in front of you quickly, that's better. There was one more issue that if I want to watch some movie from my laptop because my laptop have OLED display, which is so cool. Oh God, I just love this thing. So yeah, so if I want to watch Demon Slayer because the anime visuals are really good from my laptop, then how, how I do it? Like I usually what I was doing is I was running a Python server. So let me show you. So like something like this shows the Python minus M. Okay, HTTP server, something like this. So, I don't know, like, yeah, so in so something like this. And then, for example, Demon Slayer season two. So I can just copy this link and this link I can play with MPV. All right, so it's playing. But instead of 0, 0.0.0, 0, 0, what I can do is I can do IP DDR, this IP address. And if my laptop is in the local network, then this is something I can do in order to watch from a laptop. And if I just play it, it will work. But then I realize this is pathetic why I'm doing this, why I hate myself why I'm even using Linux, why can't I just go back to Windows? Okay, so the thing is that what I did is I realized there is something called Jellyfin, okay? So Jellyfin, uh, I don't know the package. I don't know the package, oh, server, okay, bin, I guess. All right, so yeah, something called Jellyfin. Now Jellyfin is a media server and I love this thing. I can't wait, okay. I, 
I want to show it to you. It just, you know, like just tell you. The fact. Okay, so this is the Jellyfin. Just install the binary pre-build. It will be fast or just install Jellyfin, okay? So after installing it, you have to run the service. So sudo system. So by the way, I started using DAOs, not in this computer, but on live laptop. I also started using hyperlane in laptop. So soon this thing will go away. All right, I, I started hating XORG. Fuck XORG, why I was using XORG, it's so bad. All right, so I, I'm in love with hyperlane. Soon you will just, hi, soon you, you will see everything will change on this channel complete way long way land now okay so sudo system cto god i should just make video okay so yeah so this is the service which you have to start i hope you know how to start the service so my service is running always running always have been running okay so now if I, in my here if i just open Jellyfin, it works. Now the thing is, you might see this all, or you know, you you will feel cool. Okay, this is nice, but actually it sucks. Okay, if I play something, uh, why I'm showing you my Disney collection? Okay, so if I play this movie, it's going to take some time. Like if I seek, it's going to take some time. It's not instant. And if I say play something random, okay, I hope this. You, you can see why I'm even you know waiting so let me just close this and few days ago i tried installing this thing jellyfin media player and this is actually a client and just use this client don't go for any tui and stuff it's pathetic so uh i mean it doesn't make sense then why not just use mpv and why even jellyfin i mean yeah it does make sense but okay fine so i installed this thing and this is so fast i i just fall in love with i mean it yeah it installed some qt engine and stuff but it 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 is so fast let me show you see yeah, this video is not edited by the way so let me show you my collection by the way there's so many people ask so, okay so this is like my movie collection i i watch movies asian movies south korean movies all kind of movies uh yeah Recently, I was watching this. Okay, so get back, get back, get back, back. I have some animes and I have some this anime shows. See an experiment lane, made of my favorite. Okay, so yeah, that's it. I got some Disney collection too. Weird, right? Okay, I watched Sailor Moon while eating dinner. Okay, so I have this jellyfin and here is the setting so let me show you how to change theme so because that's what we care about every theme is shit you might want to download from you know online but i believe like the dark theme is the best there is no need of changing theme anyway uh every time i show my emacs or anything i just start changing theme like nothing else i know so how to add library it's super simple if you okay don't change theme just just live with the dark where it is okay also i have jellyfin installed in my phone as an app so you can install it from after right i have jellyfin installed okay in my television it's a proprietary samsung 4k television okay tv i use samsung browser to just open jellyfin so in your local server you can do it i i found a one guy who have like a jellyfin hosted in a seed box which is cool but i don't like it i mean i want to have things locally on my computer but if i you know do some seeding in my private tracker then maybe someday i, I don't know and please don't write things like pt or something in the comments otherwise this channel will die Okay, so here, this library section, you just have to add media. Also, one thing which I want to tell you, why I'm not telling you. The permissions to run Jellyfin is kind of fucked up. So you have to be careful about it. So for example, if I do ls-l, I wanted to make a video about permissions actually. So just ignore this file here. I don't know why the permissions are correct. Let me fix it. JTB fix. So yeah, now it's fixed. Okay, not fix. Oh, it's the ownership. Oh, fuck. Wait a second. CH own uh, jellyfin, jellyfin, or uh, the power of the power of. Yeah. Fuck. 
so the thing is the files which you want to import in jellyfin need to have like the ownership of okay just one more second oh god i should have done this before i i can't live with this just all right so you have to provide the per let's just ignore this time okay so you have to change the ownership to jellyfin completely jellyfin is the group otherwise you won't be able to import it also you might also want to change the permission of the directory and the files uh, according to okay so in my computer i have it managed in a way so my user can do some changes to these files okay uh, but if you want you can make it like so you won't be able to delete it like your user won't be able to delete it which is kind of safe like you don't want to accidentally delete your movies and stuff and in files as you can see i have these permissions so yeah these this is just my permissions like in files this is the permission and i have some alias so let me just show you my alias so and you know in my chat in my videos when i make videos you might think what the fuck i'm doing but actually for those who actually understand this stuff uh i just tell them everything where they might get struck so uh, this is what i'm doing right now so here you can see i got these two uh, aliases which uh, so this one just fix for all the directories and uh, this is the permissions and this is one this is the one for all the files okay so if you are trying out jellyfin first of all try out jellyfin many people are still not using it then careful for the permissions on the permissions and get a hard drive you know fill it with stuff like make sure you got everything filled up and multiple hard drives maybe okay and yeah that's it that's my video all right thanks for watching